Lord of Roman is located in Jonah's here in the section of the two. She waits until you render the bloom. So you will do something like this and then you see how it will end up. So with that much ado, let's get started. First of all, what you do is you head to your movie. And then this is a panel that has you know every scenes in it. So you have to choose your record. So when you've done that, so as you can see this, you have um is in and then so when you hit on this, it will actually uh ease in like it will go fast and it will move as fast as the video, it won't start and um, slow and then end in um fast way, but it will be as fast as it is. So let's hit on this and then hit on this as well. What we will do next is we have to um shoot our first shot, which um, will be our first um snap of the movie. So this is it. And as we have it like this, what we do is we have to um navigate around to see where everything is. So let's move and take our subsequent shots as well. So I'll come here and take shot. I'll come here also and then um last two as um somewhere like this. Okay, and I'll take a shot. Now let's um play it and see. Right, so this is how it's normal. And this is how we want it to move. Okay. So you can actually um change the time. So it's either uh, 10. This is actually in six. So for me, I'll do like 6. It is cool for me. 6. So hit on enter. And it's uh, register. Hit on pause. And and then. There is it. There you have it. If you are done with your um, scenes and, and taking your shots and everything, hit on the save here and then save it. So this is it as it is moving. So next, what we will do next is uh, uh, with our shot. Okay, so this shot will be our second shot. So what we will do is hit this like we did before, but except this time around, we will move back and forward. So we will do something like um, this. For example, you see, it's like this. It's just um, stagnant. It ain't moving anywhere. So what we will do is hit on the pause, select this, and then with the focal length, move forward. So um, something like this is okay for me. So I'll just hit on refresh, and so this press it again as I want. So let's hit on play and as you can see it is just moving however we can also do the same thing with this one in this scene I want it to be at the back side so it should you know, go back a level to this side I think it's okay then hit on your push and there you go so it's start from the back and then it's just moving forward now this is Perfect. This thing should be, I think, um, let's hit on our seat. Now, as we've done with this, we are not done yet. You have to add our um, effects. Now, if you have the same effects, you can add it. If you don't, well, I think you have to create your own thing. In my K 
case I have it saved. So what I'll do is I'll just have to click and it will all be okay. So let's use this one. So this is uh you know depth of field D O F and in this scene we will use our DOF very 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 useful so to get a very nice you know, scene so what you do is just this up to hit on this and then you will edit it so this is how you use DOF you select where you want your focal to be and then you just have to hit on it again to save it so as you can see this is it Right. If I hit it, it will go like I want it to go. But it's not yet done because there are a lot of editing I need to do in this effect. So follow me and stay tuned. Okay, so let's ask we are now the lens play and everything and let's move um forward to the DOF again. Now in this DOF I just want it to be auto focus and also have a sharp area size. So something like um this wouldn't be bad and focal length or focus distance should be like this that I want it. And the program should be actually big on um, And also, we're not done with the sharp size, but you know, it should be very blurry at the background. So, something like this, I think, is perfect. So, when you are done with this, uh, you move on to the second one, which is our first show that you did. These two will do the same thing here. If you have any saved effect, you use it. If you don't, create your own effect. But hit on and add effect here. You can add any effect as much as you want. Now I have my own effect, and what I'll do is I'll just have to add them. So let me just add my effect, and there I go. Load effect, and I just have to load my effect. Okay, so this. It's my effect. I will just have to uh, disable the DOF just like that, and it is disabled. Now this effect is um, cool. I love this effect, and it's very, very, very cool. So I will keep it, and let's um, render it and see how it will look at. It will look like at the end. Stay tuned. Let's use um. Uh, HD and see, no, let's use this and see. See ya. Let me just uh, save it.
so this is the end uh thank you for watching please like and subscribe hit the bell madam so every day we drop you'll be the first person to watch